All right, so, you know, I got to look at this whole Will Smith, Jada Pinkett video, and uh, I was flabbergasted to say the least. Uh, check it out. You need to say clearly what happened. As far as what? You and I decided we were going to take our space and what happened. Yeah, and then I got into an entanglement with August. That's what I said. An entanglement? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. A relationship. Yes, it was a yeah. relationship. Absolutely. I was in a lot of pain and I was very broken. Now, in the process of that relationship, I definitely realized that you can't find happiness outside of yourself. Mm -hmm. And luckily enough, you... Whew. Now, I just want to say that I've always known Will Smith to be one of the greatest actors of our generation, but for him to display so much courage and just such a steel face in this particular time and not break because I could clearly see the pain, I could see the hurt, I could see the anguish all in Will's face. And he's clearly a lot stronger than me, not only as a man, but as a husband, because I don't know if I would have been able to take that as much as I love my wife, which I love dearly. Um, this was incredible. Uh, just to see the, 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 the endurance, the perseverance. The pre Let's talk about perseverance in relationships. You know, you, you, you think you're enough as a man. You, you think you're providing enough. You think you, you're doing enough. Let's just say, for instance, you're the supervisor of, of a footlocker. You're the regional manager of UPS. And you've been doing everything right, paying the bills on time making sure everything was taken care of, getting the kids to and from school every single day. But for some reason, that's not enough. I'm only saying it to say, if Jada was tired of Will Smith, imagine what us regular brothers are going to through. I, I just, or most regular brothers are going through. And could you imagine, ladies, if this role was reversed and if this was Will telling Jada this instead of Jada telling Will this, that would have been crazy. That would have been a true, true firestorm. But these are the things that happen in relationships and marriages and things of that nature. And I think what I found to be most painful was when she said she was entangled. Now, I'm not going to cuss in this video, use any type of profanity or, or obscene remarks. But when you tell me you've been messing with another man outside of our relationship, and, and granted, we were having problems. But when you say entangled, as a man, that only clicks in my head as entangled. What, what do you, it, it was. It was that long? It had that much girth that you got entangled? You got entangled? You got entangled? So you telling me you was playing with a lion's tail. That, and, and right there, that just really uh, destroys the male ego. That really hurts. So shout out to uh, Will for being brave in this time. Shout out to Jada also for having the courage and for them to uh, come together because there's no way. I mean, I couldn't imagine if I was Will Smith, like this big movie star, rapper. And, I mean, most guys, could you imagine, fellas, if you was Will and this is what your woman tells you? And you might be thinking in your mind, I am about to roll back the gates of hell, like everybody wants me. Like that's what you would say, but through Will's resilience, through his strength, he was able to refrain from letting that ego come in and swoop down on him and trying to get revenge. So 
he was clearly strong and I only pray for you guys, but entangle, 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 entangle. I want all of you all right now to look at your neighbor and say entangle, entangle. <laughs> all I think of is an extension cord and you know, pause, but, and that's only because I will be thinking of my wife getting entangled can we say elephant snap this is the only thing I know an elephant's trunk will get entangled what gets entangled 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 so I'm you, you know shout out to the Smiths this was brave uh, I guess we could all learn from this everybody in relationship or married um, we can all Take a deep breath and learn. And also, ladies, hopefully you can learn, too, uh, in using, uh, I guess what you would call a, a double-edged sword and know that, you know, women step out, too, and get they swerve on. So don't just point all of this to the faithful man. And, you know, as once said by one of the great comedians, my great friend Carlos Miller, black men don't cheat, um, who termed that phrase. And after that phrase, I don't know, some other people took it and ran with it. But I tell you, this, this really, uh, I am, I've learned a lot and I'm, I'm more open now, I guess I could say as a person. So shout out to the Smiths. And uh, I'm LeVar Walker. Take care.